to episode 18 of Beat the First Man. Uh, the last 16 of the Euros by Dice uh, has been gripping stuff so far, I'm sure you'll all agree. Um, but quickly, before we start with that, uh, obviously we do have a regular show which comes on a Saturday, which features, as you know, the Lineal European Cup and Lineal UEFA Cup. Uh, well, tonight the Lineal UEFA Cup is back up for grabs. Uh, Real Madrid, the current holders, they travel to lowly Elche, um, looking to defend their trophy. Elche sitting third bottom in the table, only one win at home all season. Uh, real tough ask for them, but what an opportunity to lift the European trophy. So uh, keep an eye on that one out later. So it's Elche v Real Madrid in the Lineal UEFA Cup final. But um, the Euros by Dice, so we're at the last 16 today. Um, tomorrow we'll have the quarterfinals, the semi-final and the final all played out in one. I was talking about doing it on Zoom. I'm not going to. I'm just going to record it in the morning as I've been doing with these. So um, so when you wake up tomorrow, you should have the winners of the Euros. So make sure you've, um, as well as subscribe, make sure you've hit that little uh, little bell button, which is notifications, and it will drop straight into your inbox and you'll never miss another episode either. So well worth doing because I'm terrible for it. I'm subscribed to loads of channels and not set my notifications up. Um, so try, try and remember to do it. So, but... Uh, the last 16 let's crack on with it so just to run through the fixtures so you've got Italy v Finland Turkey v Austria North Macedonia v Spain Russia v Germany Scotland v Sweden Portugal v Switzerland England v Hungary and Slovakia v Czech Republic uh, what we'll do as well we'll do this as we go along so we know who's going to be playing in the quarterfinals so there'll be a bit of looking down and right in but uh, just stick with it as I say, I'm not trying to run match of the day or anything, so uh, let's just uh, go with it. So the first game, so Italy versus Finland. In fact, let me just write down quarterfinal one, quarterfinal two, quarterfinal three, quarterfinal four. That's going to make life a little bit easier and smoother. So Italy v Finland. So the rules, pretty simple. So we'll roll the match. If it's a draw, we'll roll again for extra time. If it's a draw in the extra time, we roll again for penalties and we just keep going until we've got a winner. So uh, we'll start with normal time, Italy v Finland. So Italy four, Finland six. So Finland, unbelievably, are through to the quarterfinals. Um, what a story. The Scandinavian minnows in the last eight of the Euros. What a story. So uh, game two, so Turkey v Austria. So it's Turkey two. Austria 6, so Austria uh, are also through, they go through to the second quarter final, so uh, North Macedonia, the story of the tournament so far, uh, Kian's tip right at the start, he said they'd win it, what a challenge for them today, they're facing Spain, so can they pull off another shock to get into the last eight, so North Macedonia 2, Spain 2, so we go to extra time. Uh, so here we go, extra time, North Macedonia 6, Spain 6, we go to penalties, so North Macedonia 2, Spain 5, so Spain have won on penalties, uh, poor North Macedonia, so near yet yeah, so far, um, but it's Spain who progress, uh, and Spain will play Finland in the quarterfinals, so that's one of the quarterfinal um, setups all done and dusted. So Russia v Germany. Russia, you might remember, won every single game in their group. So they've been flying in the tournament. Russia 3, Germany 5. But uh, it means nothing in knockout stages. Um, and it's Germany who progress. And they go into quarterfinal 2. So Germany will meet Austria in the last 8. So uh, the Germans seeing off Russia. So here we go, Scotland, the first of the home nations. There's only two left, Scotland and England. Scotland against Sweden. Can the Scots progress to the quarterfinals? So Scotland three, Sweden four. The dream is over. Ah, uh, oh, it wasn't to be. It wasn't to be. So it's Sweden that progressed to the quarterfinals at the expense of Scotland. Uh, it's, been a, it's been a great journey. It's the furthest we've ever been, so I'm quite happy with that. So uh, Portugal v Switzerland. Um, the winners of this actually get Sweden in the quarterfinals. So Portugal 2, Switzerland 1. So a low score in a fair, but it's Portugal who progress. So Portugal will play Sweden. So 
Uh, England, the last of the home nations, won every game in the group. Can they see off Hungary in the quarterfinals? So England, six. Hungary, five. Another 6-5 win for Hungary. Uh, for England, sorry. They've got to sort that leaky defence if they want to finish this tournament off in style. But uh, it is England that go through to the quarterfinals. And they will meet either Slovakia or Czech Republic. So the big derby match. So it's Slovakia, five. Czech Republic four, so it's Slovakia that progress. So we have our quarterfinal draw. Um, so just to go through it, so quarterfinal one, Portugal v Sweden. Quarterfinal two, Germany v Austria. Quarterfinal three, Spain v Finland. And quarterfinal four, Slovakia v England. Just looking a little bit ahead because it is what we do in tournaments. So whenever we're watching a tournament, we try and look forward. So the winner of quarterfinal two, so it's it's in the semis, it would pan out like this. It's Germany or Austria will play Portugal or Sweden. And then Spain or Finland will play Slovakia or England. So there we go. So an, another dramatic twist and poor North Macedonia. So near yet so far, out on penalties to Spain. Um, the Scots have gone as well. So there's only one home nation left. Just England left now carrying the hopes for, um, for the home nations. So... Um, that's it. Tomorrow we're back with the quarterfinals, the semi-final and the final. Enjoy your day, stay safe and see you tomorrow.